Hello there, everybody. Welcome to Broken Age. It is a game that I have been very excited for. I've been waiting to play this thing for a while. It was kickstarted, now it's here, and I hope you're as excited as I am, because I'm playing it. And we're just going to breeze through this thing. I can't wait to see what's in store. I hear it's very, very good, and I think this is one of those things we need to experience together. So, without further ado, let's start this thing. Uh, yeah, save one. Ooh, okay, so I get to choose which story I go with first. So for those of you who don't know, it's it's two stories that are in some way connected, but not. I, I I'm not really sure what I'm getting into here. Let's start with her story first. Bella! Bella! Are you out here, Bella? I'm sleeping, kid. Leave me be. All right, Come what? Come on, Bella. Everybody's waiting for you. All right, hold on. Do I click on her? Like, wake up. Hold on, you little it's brat. it's time to face the cupcakes. Cupcakes aren't so bad. Are you doing this on purpose to bug me? Possibly. I mean, it's a possibility. Or did you get eaten by a bear? No, no bears. I just want to look around. That's the whole it's point of a point and click. I know you're lying because we don't have bears around here. <laughs> oh, you're too cute. All right. Worried that I chickened out? No! I know you're not afraid of anything. I mean, what's to fear? This is a great honor. Right! Wait, I can't tell if you're being serious. Well, there is one part that I'm really afraid of. What's that? I'm afraid that you won't get any food because I'm going to beat you to the Maiden's Feast. Dream on! Oh, oh, no, she's... You are losing! You, you are... Monkey? I guess this means go in. Yo, okay, we're in. Hello? Shh. Oh, is it a surprise party? What do, <laughs> what do I do? Do I do, go fire? It is surprise! surprise! Whoa. Yay! <laughs> there is my Valoria. Oh, look at my pretty girl. I can't believe. I just can't believe. We're very proud of you. I think that's what your mother is trying to say. Oh, she's not even dressed yet? Can we do that after cake? Come on, cake first! All right, but come on. Let's get this good time over with. Oh, yes, cake. Now, where did I put that knife? Don't Nobody do touches it, that cake until I find the ceremonial knife. <sighs> Gr Grandpa, not a fan of knives. He eats cake the way it was intended, with your hands. I talk to these people like, uh, hey, sis. Know where mom's knife is, Rocky? If I did, we'd all be eating cake right now. Good point. Girl's got a point. I assume dad. Don't suppose you have another knife in the back we can use? I do, but your mom brought out a special one she wants to use. She wants everything to be perfect on your special day. Granny, you seem pretty all about business. Lavina? What is it, girl? Any idea where the knife is? Any idea where mom's knife is? We're late. If I knew, I would have cut that cake, shoved it down your gullets, and had us out the door already. Oh. Damn, all about business. Uh, can I ask you about the feast? Yeah, what is going on? Can I ask you about the maiden's feast? Weren't you paying attention in maiden training? Imagine I wasn't. Um, yeah. How many of these feasts have you organized? Let's see. A new Grand Mog appears every 14 years, and I'd have seen six of them, so... Hey! Are you trying to get my age out of me? I'll never tell. What is Mog Chathra? 
What is Mog Chathra? The latest in a long, distinguished line of grand mogs to visit our land. Distinguished? Well, anything that lives that long becomes distinguished. I mean, look at me! <laughs> Zing! All right, but what what is it? Where where does it come from? Where do creatures like Mog Chathra come from? They come from beyond the plague dam. That doesn't sound like a good thing, Granny. That the plague dam? I want to go beyond the plague dam someday. It's forbidden, but maybe you'll be lucky enough to be taken there soon in Mog Chathra's stomach. I'm sorry, what now? What now? Uh, breadhead granny, can you repeat that? What? Why was I? Ch Am I gonna be eaten? Why was I chosen? In every town visited by a grand mog, the villagers vote for the maidens who represent their town's best qualities. So, in other words, beats me. To be eaten? Okay, what? How much do we know about these grand mogs? The grand mogs have visited our lands for as long as anyone can remember. They hide in the wilderness for years, and then they come to feed. After feeding, they return to their land and, it is imagined, breed. You actually imagine that? Eh. <laughs> Grail, Granny's got a lot of free time. Mob Chathra attacks other towns? Of course. Maryloft just had their maiden's feast yesterday. That's how we know he's coming here next. <sighs> They're a pretty tough act to follow. Amazing feather work. Okay, I think I know all I need to know about the Maiden's Feast. All you need to know is how to look pretty in your dress. We'll take care of the rest. By feeding me to... This is a very good question. Why don't we kill this thing? Why is everyone so okay with what's going on here? Why are we having cake? All questions I'd like to know. So why don't we just fight Mog Chathra? Silence! Talk like that could ruin the Maiden's Feast. If you destroy the feast, Mog Chathra will destroy this village, including your family. Is that what you want? No. I'd better go look for that knife. And hurry. If we're late, you won't be selected and your family will be shamed. Hmm. I mean, that doesn't sound too bad. If there are other people doing it, just let them. Throw like a stuffed animal in a dress. Boom, we're good. Right? Hmm, okay. Oh, oh. What was that? Is this a thing? Maybe the knife is under this towel. Maybe. <laughs> Never gonna find it. Dad, I hope you're not hiding that knife for your own good. <laughs> nope, not there. Oh, can I touch a cupcake? Don't touch the red ones! Mom made those just for me! You're going to eat all of those? I've already had six! <laughs> Holy shit! That explains a lot. <laughs> now that's a cute-ass kid. All right, the white ones then. You eat the one you've got before you grab another. Mom, it's her special day. Let her have all the cupcakes she wants. Thank you. Except the red ones. Did I leave it in the kitchen? Okay, so do I have a... Ooh, I have inventory. Delightful. Oh, and then I can switch over to this kid? But what do you know? Okay. Um, Mom. It obviously wants me to go talk to Mom? Grandpa. I'm going to talk to him I was last. just wondering, what if we fought the monster instead of feeding it? That's my girl. Now that's beast ender blood talking. Please, my loves, don't make this any harder than it already is. <laughs> All right. Grandpa, look, it's just you and me against the world. Grandpa beast ender? <laughs> why so why so grumpy, Gramps? Why so grumpy, Gramps? Because we're celebrating something that's a mockery of what this town used to stand for. Hmm. Yeah, agree. Yeah, I'm not sure how I feel about this Maiden's Feast either, to tell you the truth. Then fight it, girl! Stand up for yourself! I hope you're not filling that girl's head with nonsense, Brummel. <laughs> grumble, grumble, grumble. I like him. I like, I, like, I like what's going on with this guy. Why do you hate the Maiden's Feast, Grandpa? Grumble, grumble, because grumble. this used to be a town of warriors. It's a travesty, Bella. Yeah, why do we stop? Why'd we stop being warriors? Levina Clench and her ilk said there was too much bloodshed, pushed for appeasement. So we went soft, became a town of bakers. The softest there ever was. Bakers. Making cupcakes and, I assume, bread and other 
baked goods. Softies, all of them. Hey, Gramps, want a cupcake? Um, yes. <laughs> oh! So can I give him the cupcake I just got? Well, hold on. Let me ask him about the knife. Do you know where Mom's knife is? <laughs> Wouldn't tell you if I did. I'm not doing one thing to help with this shame feast. I'd better go find that knife. Don't you dare. I hid it for a reason. Oh. You did what? Oh, nothing. Caught you red-handed. Okay, what if I give him a cupcake? Like, have a cupcake, old man. For me? Yeah, why not? Uh... Can we split it? Look, I mean, I want—I kind of want some of that cupcake. Split it with you? Deal. Nice. Oh, the knife! You big dummy! Grab it, grab it, grab that knife. On second thought, you can have the whole thing. Suit yourself. Now, where did I put that thing? I stole what it, old thing? man. Uh, nothing. Uh, I didn't say anything. Delightful. Okay. Let's go over here. Then I guess give knife to mom. And then... All right, time to serve this girl up. But first, can I ask just one more time? Honey, why don't we just kill Mog Chothra? <laughs> <laughs> why are you laughing? Get here! <laughs> oh, honey. Oh, we're going to miss your sense of humor. When you get eaten. Majestic to behold. Awe-inspiring. Powerful. Mysterious. But Mog Chathra is more than that. Merciful and generous, Mog Chathra keeps our town safe. All he asks is may he pick some of our beautiful flowers as he passes through. Please come, Mog Chathra, and make your selections. Welcome to the Maiden's Feast. Show him what you're made of, Bella. I know he'll pick you. This can't be right. Agreed. Agreed. This is all happening very no, quickly. It's not right. For one thing, I should be in the center. Oh, I hate you. <laughs> I make myself the center of any room I'm in. Center of mass, maybe. Hey, oh. No more ugliness, girls. Mog Chothra responds to beauty above all else. Sorry, but beauty is nothing without a little heat. Okay. I'm waiting for whatever. That bird wants that damn piece of chicken or whatever. Isn't that cannibalism? <laughs> that bird is a crazy bird cannibal. Okay. So is whatever this is supposed to be coming? I don't see it. I guess I need to be doing things. Okay, uh, let's talk to you, Delish. Hey, does that costume have any thorns we can use as weapons? It does, but they're made out of chocolate. Regardless, I accept my noble burden, not with apprehension, but with joy. I give my life so that no harm comes to our village. Oh, you're crazy. No, I give my life. No, you're crazy no, too. me. You're also Sheesh. crazy. Yeah. All of you are nuts. Except for that bird. He is the most nuts. Uh, what about you, fun size? Oh. Uh, hey, what do you say we make a break out? Yeah. Hey, what do you say we break out of here? Trying to get us all to quit so you'll win the feast, huh? Well, it's not gonna work on me. I'm in it to win it, baby. Um. Okay. Oh, you're making me hungry? You're making me hungry. I'm trying to make Mog Chathra hungry. These girls have it all backwards. Think it's attractive to starve themselves. Wanna trade something for a bite of that drumstick? Um. Sure. Want to trade something for a bite of that drumstick? Hmm. What do you got? I... I don't know. I... Need a towel? Need a towel? Nope. They taught us to eat daintily in finishing school. I'm warning you, buzzard! I will fuck you alive if you come <laughs> near my food again! <laughs> I'm telling you, that buzzard's going crazy. Okay, uh... How about the satisfaction of helping out a fellow maiden? Oh, she's gonna hmm. say no to that. Sounds good, but not half as satisfying as this drumstick. Never mind. Hmm. All right. Well, I can't get it. So good Just luck. Just wanted uh... to say good luck. Bye. 
Can I use this knife on that damn bird? Like, cut him out of the sky? Like how, like how I'm trying to get out of this damn thing? Okay, um... Drink me, girl. Okay, hey, I've got a plan. Hey, I've got a plan. I already have a plan, thanks. Attract Mog Chopra with my slender frame and be remembered forever as a hero. Well, good luck. Yeah, <laughs> whatever. These girls are crazy. All right, hot stuff. When the monster gets close, you can use your candles to burn its eyes. Don't distract me. I think I've got a chance to win this. Okay, here he comes. I hear him. Look, there he is. Oh yeah, that is that's horrifying. That's the proper look we should have. Not that. That is... No, oh, he's so majestic. Here I am, merciful King Mog Chopra, over here. Come drool no, on me. This way, Great One. I am the one you've come so far to find. Over here. I am in bloom for you. See? He's drawn to the flame like a giant moth. What? No way! He's coming my direction! Please, don't be hasty in your decision, my lord. Oh yes, take your time, look over all your options, and then after some careful consideration... <gasps> okay, that just happened. And so did that. Back out of it now. Great honor to be, uh, but I think maybe should have listened to me. I mean, you should have listened to me, you dummies. Hasty to uh, oh God, what is different? Mind. What is different? Besides her freaking out, what is different? The water? Did that just? Can I have that? What? Hey, can I have a drink of that water? Hmm. Trade you for that sweet corset you've got on. Never can be too thin. Sure, this whatever. Thing, yeah. You got a deal. So Ooh, what the hell do I use water I for? I feel so much. Nope. Oh, I'm sorry. But this thing's just too big for me. Trade back. Great. Okay, well it's in my inventory now. Oh, like, oh, oh, oh. that poor girl. Oh shit! <laughs> oh, no. That should have been me! Okay, well one thing's very clear. These okay, girls That's right. It's my time. Yeah, they don't they are not going to come with me if I try to escape. I can't talk them out of it. Fun size not get She's not giving me that damn chicken. So what the hell? Do I talk to her again? One more time? This doesn't even make any sense. Yeah? Can I borrow that bottle one more time before you're eaten? Keep it. Oh, okay. Thanks. I don't need it where I'm going. He is just eating you guys left and right. This is not so. <laughs> saving the best for last? Is that it? Hey, that's cool. I'm more of an eat dessert first type person, but <laughs> that's, that's cool. Um, can, can we just agree to one thing, though? Can you just not pick me last, please? That's all I ask. Okay. Uh, fun size? Trade something for the drumstick Wanna now? Wanna trade something for a bite of that drumstick? Hmm. What do you got? Uh... Oh man, how about this slimming... Oh no, she likes... She likes being plump and luscious. Let's try... This? How about something bubbly to wash it down? Well, thanks. Don't mind if I... Ah! <laughs> oh, and now Look she's gonna want the me. towel! I'm soaked! Nice, I got oh this. Is he looking? Quick, quick, help me put myself back together! And... 
and throw the towel. Oh, help here? I've got a towel here if you throw me that drumstick. You have a towel? Why didn't you say so? I mean, I did say so earlier. You turned me oh. down. <laughs> How long have you been standing there? And then she got eaten. This is horrifying. Are you part vulture or something? Okay, um... How can you think about food at a time like this? Can I click me? It's hard to tell where the dress ends and the cake starts. Okay, uh... Can I click him? Here, birdie. Oh, come on! So close. Do I have anything I can use on him? Can I use that knife, like... Knife yourself, bird! I don't want to stab that bird. I still need her to get out of here. Oh, yeah. And also, I'd lose my knife. You know, maybe. All I have is a corset? What the hell is that gonna do? Gotcha. Oh! 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 Pull me out! That's it. Flap those big blue wings. Just a little bit harder. <laughs> oh, shit. Um... We should probably... We should probably... What the hell am I... What the hell am I gonna do? Bird! Come on, girl. Give it all you've got. Cake! It's hard to tell where the dress ends and the cake starts. Oh! Can I use the knife to cut my... It's nice to be armed, but I wish this were more monster-sized. Like this! Hey! How about we split this cupcake? You can have the bottom half. Get back here, you crazy brat! That's my girl! She's doomed us all! Mog Chopra's fury will soon rain down upon our village! Big bird, hello. Other bird. What do you see? Where are we going? What is... What is this? Cloud City? Right now, Wiley E. Coyote's like, been there. <laughs> Wait, who are these people? Shifty-eyed yeah, bird. Look, Jesse brought back a girl with her. Ooh, a new recruit. Time for your old man to become Mr. Smooth. Uh huh. Not creepy at all, old man. Advertise like shameless whores.